up guys? It is me, Avery, and my dad, Jay Mac. Or Jeremy. Yeah, I guess you can call me Jack if you want. <laughs> Sorry. All right, so I issued my dollar, my dollar, <laughs> my dollars, yes. I issued my daughter a $15 challenge. It's dad's $30 challenge because I'm paying for all of it. But the idea was we go to our local Walmart, which is really the only place we have to buy Pokemon cards other than the internet. Um, so we get $15 a piece. I'm going to be nice and we're not going to worry about tax. So if something's $14.99, if it goes over $15 with tax, it's fine. Just the base amount, $15. And I think what we're going to do is whoever pulls the coolest looking card is going to win. And I've got a special prize that she doesn't know anything about. So 15 bucks, get whatever we can. Um, what's going to be your strategy going into this challenge? So I think about getting the Scarlet and Violet because there's some really good hits in there already. And the Miriam alternate art card is probably one of the rarest, but also the coolest looking. All right. I think I'm just going to try to find whatever I can get the most packs. Cause I think if I get the yeah. most packs, I can get better chance of getting hits to get something cool. So like I said, we're going to go to Walmart. We'll be back in a minute to see what we find. All right, we are back from our trip from Walmart, which like I said earlier, one of the only places that we can really buy Pokemon cards other than the internet. So, so $15 challenge, it was, you had $15, tax not included. Yeah. What did you get? So I got three of the Scarlet and Violet. They were three eighty dollars a pack, because they were on sale, so. Okay. And then I found this bad boy for the new low price of $15. So I learned from my last video, we're gonna cut for a second while I open this big thing up because it makes a lot of noise, so I'll be right back. Okay, so for my pack, um, I wasn't really paying attention or I, since I don't know all the newer stuff, um, I didn't really know what I was getting. So I knew I was gonna get this, it, but this is the Pokemon Go packages. So I got four of the Pokemon Go's. Um, just saw the full card I got. Got the big card, which I'm not just a huge fan of. And then I got this thing right here, which gave me some rewards in Pokemon Go, maybe. So I'll try those codes out, see what I get. Because we play Pokemon Go. So, okay. Um, so I got these two right here, and then we got this one, which is heavy. So, I'm wondering what's in this one. Same question okay. for last. So, you got one pack that feels heavier than the others. Yeah. Okay. So, here's $15 challenge. Whoever gets the coolest card is going to win an additional prize. But, if we can't agree on who gets the coolest card, then we'll go through and see who got the most expensive card. So, you ready? Yeah. All right. So, again, we'll get set up a little better with two cameras so we can kind of see what's going on. So... Magikarp, always love Magikarp. Ooh, Meltan. Meltan's pretty cool. Eevee. Eevee's one of my favorite Pokemon. I actually am working on a new profile picture for us, which has an Eevee. Okay, so I got a foil spark, one of the trainers. Oh, oh okay. So I got a rare for the Pikachu. So that's pretty cool. I'll be right back. Okay, yeah, you can get the cat. Uh, that, and looks like War Turtle, Ivysaur, and of course, Code Card. Alright, so, Our cat's making noise. I went with this set because on the packages it had some of the original uh, Pokemon, which I'm more familiar with, so I thought I'd get a little more enjoyment out of pulling cards that I'm more familiar with. Alright, am I going to keep going, or you want to go next? I want to go next. Okay. So we got a Meltan. Oh, is that Meltan? Or... No, Magneton. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Learn your Pokemon, kid. Um, how do you pronounce that? Uh, Closet... Closet... Zer. Closet, sir? <laughs> closet, sir. Ooh, this is the new... Great... Grieva... <laughs> Grievard. All right. Well, don't, don't worry about pronouncing names. We'll just kind of go through there and then... If you see something cool, we'll look at it. Otherwise, we'll make 
two hour long videos. Oh, I see something. Oh. Oh, that's pretty cool. Don Dozo. And it's full art. Full art. So that's that's pretty and cool. And I got a hollow professor's research. Okay, well, so far, I think you're winning the challenge because my Pikachu is cool, but it's not as cool as oh, a full art Oh, and card. this is the rare, and then we have this, which has a gold. A gold star or oh, silver star? this looks like it might be a special rare. Okay. Definitely a cool looking card. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is special rare, guys, if it'll focus. You must pull it back just a little bit. Yeah. Okay, so going through mine, we've got Tranquil, Larvitar, Natu, Apom, Slowpoke. Oh, okay, so I have a Reverse oh. Hollow Foil Sylveon. Oh, what's next? Oh. Oh, that's a gold Mewtwo. Mewtwo V. That's a Apparently, card. it is gold, so it's, it's a, a V Star. No, Dad, that's a gold card. Those are rare. They're okay, really sure. rare? Here, wait, let me... Okay, well, you can look at it and let's see what else I got. Uh, energy... This is a guitar. special rare, I'm pretty sure. Okay, well, that's a pretty cool card. <laughs> that's a really cool card. I love Mewtwo. Again, I'm with the okay, original 151. See. So we got... Okay, okay. Nothing too good yet. I see something in the back, and I'm really interested. Okay. Oh, reverse hollow. Uh-huh. Another reverse hollow. Okay. A hollow, and... Oh, nothing good. Okay. That. So, I got some pretty good cards from well, that. So, uh, uh, first pack, that's a pretty cool card there. Okay, that was just that little code card. All right. Charmillion. Badoof. Wimpod, Dub, another Magikarp. Okay, Reverse Foil, Numel. Hoo hoo. Okay, so again, I'm with Old School Original. Um, I miss having my bird cards. So, I got Articuno as my rare. That's pretty sweet. And then we got Unipheasant, a Rare Candy, and Camera Up. So, not bad, but I, I miss my, my having my bird cards, so that's good getting the Articuno. Okay. I'm curious what I'm getting in this pack, because this was that heavy one. Okay, so it was your heavy pack. Yeah. I see black in the very back, Dad. I'm very interested. Okay. I hope it but is. But is black better than gold? Oh, this is a reverse hollow. Okay. Another reverse hollow. Ooh, what is that? Magna Magnazone. Pretty cool. That is pretty cool. And a regular energy. All right, so. So that was the end of my packs. Okay, so Magnazone EX. Okay, so you got your three packs. I got my kit that had four of them. Okay, so that's the little code card. I don't care about that. All right, so Slowpoke, Badu, Magikarp, just like the other pack. Uh, Meltan, okay. Looks like another numeral there. Stars. All right, my rare is a Snorlax, which is cool. I like Snorlax. And then Energy, another Spark, spark. and then Steelix. He's cool. Okay, so just a quick recap. I got Snorlax, which is cool, but definitely not the coolest card. Um, Articuno, super happy to get that. I love the legendary birds. Um, I got a reverse foil Sylveon, which is cool because I love Eevee. Um, and then this was a good little, just throwback, good hollow full Pikachu, you know, iconic Pokemon. Uh, reverse foil Spark. And then I think this is my prize. This gold V-Star Mew too. I think that's my coolest card. So going through mine as a recap, we have the Hollow Professor's Research, Reverse Hollow. Um, what's its name? 
Ponard, mm. the reverse hall. I got a lot of reverse hollows. Mm -hmm. Um, Fli Flittle, whatever this ram's name is. Of course, the final evolution of Fuecoco, which is. Skeledurge? Yeah, Skeledurge. This thing that we had trouble pronouncing. <laughs> Energy switch. Oops, and then probably my. So the coolest is definitely going to be this because it's full art. Yeah. But I also really like this one. Okay. So. So now we got to decide is who got the coolest card. I, I'm really digging my Mewtwo V Star Gold. I think that beats. Yeah, but but th th this is pretty cool. Okay, so it looks really. Cool. Okay, so we both want the prize. You don't even know what the prize is. So no. Here's what we're gonna have to do. We're gonna have to go look on the internet, see what these cards are selling for, see. Which one sells for the most? Um, not slab cards or graded cards because, you know, we have no clue what these would grade for. So just basic cards as is. See what they go for. We'll be right back. <laughs> all right. So just kind of looking at what cards are going for on eBay. That's from all my years of collecting. eBay's for me, is one of the better sites to go to. Just filter by, you know, what has sold, what they sold for. Gives you a real quick idea what the market value is. So... Yours are going anywhere from a like, dollar to two dollars. Yeah. Okay. Um, this bad boy going anywhere from twenty two to like thirty. Yeah. And of course, get it graded can be a lot more. So I win the prize. <laughs> I don't but know. But the cool thing is What is <laughs> Pokeball. When did you get that? Well, um, probably when you were, you know, sleeping, because you're almost a teenager now, and you sleep until... Like, 12. Yeah. Okay, so inside this Pokeball, we get a coin, which you're going to get to have. Yeah, I, I love the coins. Okay. All right. Ooh, got tape on my finger. All right, so, does that... Oh... I was wanting to have the experience of the push the ball and open it up. Okay, so these are kind of cool. A little metal tin. All right, so first of all, the coin. Didn't you get that yesterday? No. Or do you have one of those? Yeah. Okay, well. I think I did actually get this yesterday. You get another one. I, I was, well, not yesterday, though, before, whenever we did yeah, it. Yeah, whenever we did it. Well, say the only bad thing about these tins, I don't know if you can see, a little bit of a dent. I'm kind of a stickler for perfect stuff but okay what did this give us a uh, sword and shield brilliant stars Ooh, evolving skies a uh, sword and shield evolving skies and, and then fusion fusion strike okay so i'm gonna let you open one of these i want the evolving skies the evolving skies yes okay wait can i which whichever one you want to open i know that i won the prize okay so while I'm you're like, deciding, I'm them over here. okay, I got trap itch, um, Breloom. okay, that's cool. Okay, reverse hollow of a Lipard. Oh, well, that's the that's the rare. Ooh, okay, so reverse hollow Lipard, which yeah, it looks pretty cool. Oh, and then I got a. Samasir, Samasir. I said I need to learn how to pronounce these names. V. So that's pretty cool. Um, nothing. A team yells cheer in a Sinkico. Sin, Sino, Sinsino, Sinkino. Well, <laughs> I don't know. The best card you got out of yours was okay. um, the Crop Cat, which is a reverse hollow. That was it? Yeah. What was the rare? Uh, Gorgai Swiss was rare. Okay. But yeah, that was like the only hollow. Okay, so event. then you're not not missing out since you didn't win. Okay. So I got, try to get here where they kind of zoom in. Uh, What is that, a Dreepy? 
Ooh. I don't know what a dreepy is. It's from Galois. Okay. <laughs> okay. Verse foil Dracloak. That's evo the evolution of Dreepy. Okay. That's cool. Oh, what we got? Oh, All right. Doug Dodrio V. All right. Grab the strike. So it's pretty cool. Shiny. I like shiny stuff. And then a Heatmore, a Cook, and then a Morgrim, which I'm not familiar with. I am because they are going to catch. Okay, so uh, nothing just too amazing from the little prize pack, but I would say that for my $15, I got my money's worth. And for my $15 with you, eh, add everything up. I'm sure it probably gets up close to 15. All right, so that was our $15 challenge. Dad's the winner. Maybe next time, kid will have a little better luck. Maybe you can get jobs to make your own money, buy as much as you want. <laughs> All right, thank you guys for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed any of this, please subscribe. We greatly appreciate it and hope you have fun chasing down those Pokemon cards. Bye.